Hey guys, my name is Ace Zephyr, and today I'm going to be doing a tutorial for the Glowstone Chandelier version 3. These are the resources you'll need to build the chandelier. 30 solid blocks, not including your ceiling, a slab of any kind, a glowstone block, which will be your actual light, 12 redstone dust, 7 redstone torches, 16 repeaters, 1 comparator, 3 sticky pistons, and 2 regular pistons, a dropper, a hopper, 2 redstone blocks, and any item. You want to start off by placing two redstone dust here, a block, a repeater on four ticks, another repeater on four ticks, and a repeater on four ticks here. And you want to place um, blocks up and blocks aside and delete these two. And you want to place torches here and here, and a repeater on three ticks, a block up here, and two blocks to the side. Break this one because it isn't used for anything. And you want to place a repeater on two ticks and redstone dust here and a redstone torch. This piston 610 and then this one. And you want to place a repeater on one six and repeater on two ticks. And you want to place a block here, redstone dust, and then a block on top. Okay, you want to come back around to the back of the chandelier and you want to place a block here with redstone dust here, a block up here, another block here, and then two more blocks here and you want to place a redstone torch here and here and you want to place a block on top of here and a block right here and you want to place a repeater right here and then another repeater right here and set this one to four ticks you want to place redstone dust right here you want to place a block right here and a block up break this one and you want to place redstone dust here and then a repeater here, right here and then a repeater here and redstone dust and this is your entire opening mechanism for the first half of the retraction you want to place a block right here and a torch on the side of that block, a sticky piston there, and a block of redstone on the side, and a repeater on two ticks. Now you want to come back over to the, here, and you want to place a redstone torch right there, a dropper here, a hopper there, and then just place any random item into here. I'll just use a redstone dust because I have some. And you want to place a comparator right there, and a block up, a block to the side, break this one because it's unnecessary, a block up, and then a half slab right here, break this block. You want to place a repeater right here, redstone dust there, a block right there to cut it off, and then you want to come over here, place a block there, break this one, and you want to place two blocks over to the side, and you want to place a repeater on two ticks, and then two redstone dust right here and here. Now you want to place two blocks over here, redstone dust here, a repeater on four ticks, and you want to come down here, place a sticky piston facing down, and then place a redstone block right there, and then you want to place a block right here, and a repeater on one tick. Now we've actually finished the entire chandelier, so let's test it out. So you want to flick this lever, and it should extend, and you want to flick it again, and it should retract. Now just a little word of warning, if you want to hook this from somewhere else, you actually need to input it with a repeater, not just redstone dust, because this block has to power this redstone dust here and this redstone dust down here, both, or else the system won't work. So as I said at the beginning of this tutorial, I said there was a really quick modification you could make for this to work on bucket, because right now it does not. So here it is. Now you do need one extra repeater for this modification, so make sure you have it. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is break this repeater and replace it with redstone dust, and break this redstone dust and replace it with a repeater. Now what you want to do is break this repeater and block and redstone dust right here, and you want to place a repeater on four ticks, and you want to copy, now you just want to take this blocks up and blocks to the side, and you do need a couple more blocks also, I forgot to say that, um, and you want a repeater right there, and now what you want to do is set this repeater down here to three ticks, and you want to set this repeater here to four ticks, and this one also to four ticks. So now if we flick the lever, um, the extension is the same speed, but the retraction is a bit slower, just because of how I had to make it work on bucket. So yeah, I hope you guys like this tutorial, and thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.